go for it. It's lab day. So I'm in a grade 11 university level chemistry class right now. So today I'm going in and I actually have no idea what the lab is. I just know that um, you have to write some of the procedure for the lab and then start the reaction today and most likely be finishing it tomorrow. And I know it's definitely gonna involve a lot of stoichiometry or math. So far in this class, I've been like, um, almost failing everything and I'm like a 60s student so <laughs> um yeah no chemistry is not my fave well like it is I actually love it but I'm doing really good now that we're into the math stuff because math definitely is my fave I actually just got these like really cute Christmas earrings that I wanted to show off. So for our culminating lab, we had to design a procedure to make sodium hydrogen carbonate. And then out of the three possible outcomes and like possible products we had to calculate the stoichiometry of them all and the mass of solid product expected in each reaction in order to analyze what the products were in case he drops it um, this is the source of error, I think. So right before we went to measure our mass, I actually dropped the crucible lid on the ground and it shattered. So this is us repeating the process, but using a test tube instead, because we thought it would be better for our splint test, which proved that there was carbon dioxide in it since it went out. And I don't have footage here, but we also did a water strip test because moisture actually can't be made in the crucible, but it could in the test tube. guys welcome back to day two of the lab so today i'm just going in to the school to meet up with my partners and we're just gonna look over some calculations for it um for our hypothesis just to make sure that we all have the right numbers and whatnot yeah now we get three up. Um, if you like to come into a lab with me and want to see more videos like this, just let me know by clicking the like button. Jokes, guys. Live, laugh, love, though.